Hello, welcome back to the channel. It's Echo Stretch. In this video, we're going to go ahead and test out the new USB exploit that we uh, just created in the previous video. If you haven't seen it, you can go ahead and check it out. I will leave a link in the description and you can go ahead and check that out. I do encourage you to update your USB with a new file as it does fix previous bugs. Um, also, the host has been updated as well with the uh, new kernel exploit files as well. So we're going to put it all together and see how well it works. So we'll go over to settings. I will show you that I do not have goal 10 options and I do not have the debug settings. Then we'll go up to our network and go ahead and just make sure that we are connected to the internet. And then we'll go ahead and back out. Go ahead and launch our browser. We'll do the usual close the window, uh, delete all go into our browser history, clear that as well and then we'll go into settings and delete cookies and clear our website data. Once that's done we can go into our bookmarks. I will be using Chameleon's host so we'll go ahead and select it. Give it a few moments here. It does install the uh, cache on the first page here. From there we'll go up and select Chameleon 900 v45 and this does have the updated files in the host. Uh, so we'll go ahead and select it and give that a few moments here to install the cache. Okay, 100%. And we're good to go. Uh, you can go ahead and cache the payloads if you're looking for them. For the video, I'm just going to go ahead and launch Goal 10. So we'll go ahead and select it. We'll give it a few seconds here just to load and then uh, we'll wait for the message to pop up to insert our USB. Okay, it shouldn't take too much longer. That's about 10 seconds there. There we go. Go ahead and insert our USB and we'll wait for the message to pop up uh, on supportive file system. Okay, and once it does pop up, you don't want to hit OK right away. Give it a couple of seconds and then hit OK, and the jailbreak should be more successful for you. Go ahead and hit OK after the jailbreak is done. You can go ahead and remove the USB as well. And we should see Goal 10 2.0 B2 loaded. Once that's done, we can go ahead and hit the PlayStation button. Go over to our settings, go into Goal 10 options. You can see that we do have our options. We can load the bin loader server and that works with no issues. Go ahead and launch our FTP as well. No issues there. Let's go ahead and just test out rest mode. I believe rest mode should work, but we'll give it a test just to make sure. So we'll go ahead and enter rest mode. Uh, it does take a few moments here to boot down, but it shouldn't take too much time. This is the first time that I actually went into rest mode with the, my PS4 Pro. I'm so used to with the slim, with the uh, just the little light. Now I have like a big long light. Um, it is pulsing and uh, yeah, it's pulsing amber. So we'll wait for it to go solid. I find it does go into rest mode a lot quicker with the uh, Pro than the than the slim. The slim was a little slow. Okay, still pulsing. Okay, so we went solid there. Now I'm going to go ahead and hit the PlayStation button on the controller. I did hear the beep. It did go blue, the light. So we'll give it a few moments here to turn on. It is pulsing blue now. Okay, so we're good. Let's go ahead and log in. Go over to our settings, and we can see that Goal 10 is still there. The uh, FTP and bin loader automatically on check once you do go into rest mode, but it's not a big deal to go ahead and select them again and, and load them up. Um, but yeah, that's basically it for the video. I should point out that I did test it with Orbis's Toolbox. I enjoy using Orbis's Toolbox every time I play any games. Um, I do notice that it doesn't really work with rest mode. Um, rest mode tends to crash so um, if you're just loading the jailbreak playing your games you should be fine there should be no issues at all going into rest mode let me know in the comments below if you do load any payloads and you're you are having problems with uh, rest mode I'll give it a test and see what I can come up with 
But I'm going to leave the video at that. I hope you did enjoy it. If you did, go ahead and hit that like button. And if you're not subscribed already, go ahead and hit that subscribe button. It really helps out the channel. And I will see you in the next video. Thanks for watching.